Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Civilization VI as we continue our deity allegiance to Eleanor run. And uh, we're one turn away from getting an heroic age. Uh, that's where I left us off on a nice cliffhanger there. I did just notice before I hit the next turn that we are already starting to flip candy. And we don't have, not, not only do we not have the heroic age yet, we're still in a dark age. We also don't have the great works over here in the amphitheater and things like that. So that that bodes well that once we get actual things in place, we'll be able to start flipping these loyalties pretty quickly after that, hopefully, at least for a few of these cities. I mean, eventually we're going to run into some cities that are a little bit harder to flip. But for right now, that would be a really good start. Uh, other than that, not much else to do. We're not quite enough faith to get us another apostle, but we will be there. Um, looks like about three, four turns. So that'll be good. Uh, we do want to start spreading our religion over here and stuff like that. Because, and we do have it actually over here in Newcastle on upon Tyne, which is really good to see. But uh, we'll get some more flipped at some point. Do we, can we see in the loyalty, isn't there a loyalty viewer? Yes, there is. Can we see what's causing it? So governor, um, because of our governor here, I'm guessing she's already in place. She's helping to flip too. Uh, happiness level is obviously low. Other effects are low. I mean, they do get some nearby citizens that are helping them out. So that's, that's part of it. So we'll have to keep an eye on that a bit. I don't know what age he'll be in in a moment. Hopefully not a golden age. But let's hit next turn. All right, let's make a dedication here. I, mean, I do like reform the coinage. Plus two loyalty per turn for cities not on your original capital's continent. Might come in handy. I don't know. We might do a little bit of population settling on some of the continents just to kind of forward settle to like to our west and things like that. So I do think that, that one's going to be useful. Uh, we don't really need this one because we're not planning on going to war. So we'll take a heartbeat of steam. Those are three up. Yeah, that makes sense. That was easy enough. I should. I didn't even have to think about it that hard. Even though I did. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we're only, we're still going to take us 40 turns at the moment. He is in a normal age. So we're at least getting a little bit of advantage. Unfortunately, not enough to, you know, he was not a dark age, so we didn't get that advantage. But once we get this amphitheater in place, that will make things hugely easier here. Technically, we could buy the amphitheater for 600 gold. And we've only put like one turn into it. Honestly, that's probably an extremely good idea. The sooner we get this set up, the better. Uh, so then we want to move these over to Sunderland. Why can't we? You can't move writings? What? Have we not moved writings before? Oh. <laughs> it was like I was holding it down. It was trying to move, try to click and stuff, and it just wasn't doing anything. So weird. Um, so we'll do that. Um, Sheffield Leeds. So Leeds is how far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, leads actually would work. Oh, actually, I guess I already had those in leads. That's, that's why I put them there. Um, so we'll put that one in. Suddenly, that works. That gets us a little bit more. Yeah, he's definitely losing. He's losing 15 right now. So actually, we must have... Why does it say 40 turns? It's going to be way quicker than that. I don't think it's updated yet. We need some more great writers, though. Or get more great works of writing, which actually would be useful as well. So let's check some of this stuff real quick before I go chasing great works of writing. Do I care if y'all have iron? I don't think so. Do I care if y'all have niter? Probably. Probably a little bit more on that one. We'll accept that, and then we'll exchange. What do I want? Uh, that's what I say. I want to purchase... Great works of writing. Yeah, I mean, any of these are going to be worth it. Start with a one for now. Make sure that goes into Sunderland. And then we see we got Sheffield, Manchester, and Bradford. Manchester's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's one tile too far. Sheffield, I think, is one tile too far as well. At least one, two, three, four, five, six, 
six, seven, eight, nine. Thanks for several tiles so far. <laughs> I can't do math. Uh, in Manchester, Sheffield, Bradford. Okay, it's over there. So, yeah, so none of the other stuff is going to help us. That's okay. Sunderland. Uh, Sunderland can start working on a... Oh, yeah, I mean, obviously, this thing's for sure. Do we want art or do we want artifacts? Either or both. They're both good. Shipyard will also be really good, too, because of the extra production. We also need some housing from somewhere. Which we're not get from going to get from any of these things. Um, I mean, we're not going to have any great works of art yet, right? Uh, if we go look at great people, we're a ways away from that. So I think we start with the shipyard and then switch back to that as soon as we can here in a bit. I mean, you could use an aqueduct. I probably already build a, made a builder to go over there and chop that and just forgot about it. Um, Mark Shea, we do want to continue to spread our religion wherever we can. So, let's see if we can spread our religion to Sunderland, maybe? We'll get a little Judaism back at us, though. Let's go to Preston. Actually, if we're going to do this, let's just do this. Let's, uh, let's trade, take Tindy over to Sunderland. I mean, for right now, I could have you go chop this thing out. Why not? I guess I'm going to have you sleep. We don't need the extra point right now. So we don't need the sea dog right this second. All right. What do we want over here? I mean, starting to get some great works of art stuff wouldn't be bad. Also some more faith just to kind of get that rolling better. Code's always good. Since we don't have any art museums, I guess this one's less valuable, right? So I may just go with the gold for now, because obviously the gold can be used to purchase great people as well. I mean, we should be able to just work our way through this group. Still says 40 turns. Oh, now it's eight turns. Okay. Whatever is contrary to nature is contrary to reason. And whatsoever. We definitely want to change that. Unfortunately, we did lose the production boost, which is which was nice to have while we had it. Can barely move that up there. I mean, at this point, maybe I just plug in some. Uh, a little bit of faith just to get some more of that coming in. I mean, it's not great. We're not, we're not in a great position with some of these things. Definitely want to get better hopefully soon. Eight turns according to that. Um, I mean, we're eventually going to get this one. I, let's go and get nationalism. We know we're never going to declare war, or at least we're not planning on it. Uh, I do want to... Get, what, a couple turns away from getting us the... Uh, Profit. All right, the frigate's a little bit scary. All 
Alright, Hansa does have a quest for us, to be fair. I think we'll get another one here in a minute, though. I want to go ahead and go somewhere where we can get a little bit of production, but also get some religion back at us. So, like Newcastle. Now, we do get less coming back at us, unfortunately. Sheffield wouldn't be bad. I mean, it's not much, but at least it's further away and less likely to be affected by the uh, the uh, Judaism. It's really not that much production, though. I think I'm just going to go to Newcastle. I'm just going to accept a little bit of... I think we'll be fine with the Judaism spread, but I'm hoping we get more... Yeah, we're getting a little bit more allegiance to Eleanor spread now. We need to get this city up to a pop 10 anyway so we can get a holy site down. Of course, we don't have any religious artifacts at the moment. That actually hurt. That frigate could actually beat up on us if we're not careful. Let's move you back and get you healed back up first. I mean, obviously, we definitely want the amphitheaters and things everywhere we can. Keep getting those great works of writing. I mean, it's less critical back here because of where we're at. Oh, I forgot we already had the artist. Well, then I could have... Actually, I might buy it. Yeah, that's exactly what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to have you transfer to here. And we'll buy that art museum here in just a moment. Yeah, I don't think the amphitheater is as critical back here. Because even if we don't get all the great works of writing, we can always buy them from people. So we're going to go ahead and just do the shipyard. Let's go ahead and get the temple here. More faith coming in would be really useful. Yeah, this is going to be really nice to have that that art in that museum. And we don't have to do any sort of um, matching, right? It's just the no the quantity of great works. It has nothing to do with the... Um, it has nothing to do with uh, like any bonuses or anything like that. I mean, obviously, culture is always good. Uh, we could also get Bandar Brunei back to us, which is probably more valuable. Now we can't go in there. Um, let's just come down this way and see what we got. I mean, I do want to build an entertainment complex somewhere. Well, we already got one over here, don't we? Or where was it? Somewhere. Don't we have one? Yeah, right there. Ten turns. So they're actually, they're actually defending as much as they can right now. they got a governor in there at the moment. You know, which is unfortunate. It's slowing us down. But once we get the great works, which we can get right now... I'm sorry, one more time. We hadn't, we hadn't actually hit next turn yet. <laughs> That's because the ships disrupted me. Uh, you know what? I will take your great work of writing. And I don't mind giving up Niter for that. I saw a bank that said 24 hour banking. Oh, we need to get the thing from the banker. Is it too late? It might be too late. There's a banker thing that gives us great work slots in banks and stuff. That would be really useful. All right. First things first, grab you, go there, get the art museum. Okay, we're eight turns now, and we're going to put uh, these in here. Okay, and that should speed that up even more. I can get an apostle. Perfect.
All right. Um, I think it's about all we can do for right now. I don't want to sell any more niter. I was okay with selling the niter that we sold at that time, just because um, it got me the great work of writing, which I'm okay with. But I don't know if I want to do any more right now. I could buy some art, right? Um, but we're about to get all of our stuff what we need anyway, so we're not going to spend that right now. Oh, that wouldn't make a lot of sense. Well then, let's uh, let's just park you inside Liverpool. Keep you safe until we get some coal. All right, so we could go ahead and enhance our religion one more time, right? Um, but we could also save that until we get into a dark age again and just use that as our way to get an extra point, right? Next, a couple points. So I think what we're going to do instead was we're going to use you to spread religion. Relic is created. That would be really nice. I mean, triple strength. Um, I guess we will... Grab that, because then we can come over here and spread to candy. That might work. Granary is done. I mean, I do want the shipyard, but it's going to take forever to build. I need to get you a trade route over here. I'll start working on it, see if I can get, remember to get a trade route over there. Right, we're going to do the aqueduct. We're going to go ahead and do that. Three turns. Ooh, 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 so good. All right. Anything else? Um, we're going to save this guy for our sea dogs. We're going to save the last charge for Apostle to get a point there. Because obviously flipping Dark Ages back into Heroic Ages are going to be a pretty big deal for us, I think. We're at three turns now. He's about to get to the one where he can't craft anything anyway, or create anything else. Right, we're not quite full flipping this one yet, unfortunately. Although it has started, it did dip down a little bit. Once we get this one, I mean, it'll help a little bit, but... No, I mean, we, we still need more of these guys over here. We still got to finish this theater right here for sure. It's just a foothold. All right, let's come over here and spread religion to candy. Honestly, a farm over here actually would be a pretty good idea. Okay, last one there. You are starting to lose stuff here finally. Two turns there. Shipyard's done up here. Um... I mean, London getting an industrial zone, I think, would be a really good idea, and I have been planning that one here anyway, so I'm going to go right into that. You're still just, honestly, you're just going to kind of sleep for now. Hopefully, I remember that you exist. Like somebody wants horses? No. I want some iron, though, which I guess I'm okay with. We need to get some spies to help us push the, the loyalty stuff faster as well. That hurt. Oh, we don't have a promotion yet, do we? No, not yet. One turn. 61 turns. It's getting there. Amy 
Alright, one city. It's our very first city. Flipped through loyalty. Hopefully the first of many. Uh, obviously we're keeping it. That's the whole point of all of this. So, yeah. We can get you the temple. Uh, unfortunately, you don't have a in theater square. We have to get you up to 10 pop, which we can do once we get you a little bit of growth, right? So that's good. So yeah, let's go ahead and get the temple down. More faith will be really good for us. Uh, I guess we're going to have to repair all of that. Assuming there's nothing in candy to move anything to? Nope. That's okay. Do we have a... Uh, what is it actually? It's a relic? Is that what it is? No, just... Oh, that's the cathedral. Okay. Um, the temple itself is a relic, yes. So we either need to get a relic, or if we can get up to a cathedral by... We'd have to have a religion there, which we're... We didn't get this guy up there in time, unfortunately. Um, we can get him over here to Nabamba, though. Um, but are there any relics out there? about religious stuff in general. There are some religious things, so we might, we'll come back to that, but we definitely might want to get one of those if we can get a cathedral over here. Ugh, knight and horses for great ri works of writing. I want my knighter, but I don't need my knighter, so I guess we're going to keep doing this. Astronomy is much more fun. I mean, if we get to a point where we don't ever go to war with anybody, we don't need the Niter, right? Of course, Congo hates us, so or Zulu hates us, I should say. Of course, we're a little bit stronger than him at the moment, so maybe we're okay. Uh, actually, I don't know if I want to do the scientific theory just yet, because we're still... got several turns here. I think we want to hold off and go into the next era just for a bit. We'll go ahead and do square rigging. We're not planning on killing it with a muskman anyway. That will work. Claim a great person... I oh, mean, I guess we'll keep reclaiming these where we can. I mean, it gets us a point. I'd like to avoid the points, but I mean, it's not like we can, if we skip that, then what good is that really to us? Lighthouse is done. We do need, man, we got some, such bad production down here. I mean, we really need to get a theater square down. Uh, we could chop the forest and put it there. We're going to do that. I was moving you there. Let's move you down to there. All right. You were going to flip that, but instead we're going to come over here and we will spread religion here. All right. So we got a couple admirals that can just chill for a bit. I mean, I guess I can have you go ahead and go get an armada, make an armada out of something. Um, but of course, making an armada gets us a point. So we're going to hold off on that as well. If anything, we might want an armada of sea dogs. All right, we do want to get the theater square. But... You have the harbor. That's one. We get another one at seven, right? So we could go ahead and get a holy site too. But no, they're both going to take a long time. Let's just get... You make a trader so much quicker elsewhere. Honestly, I'm just going to spin a cycle on some harbor shipping until we get that chop done. Seven turns on the Bomba now. No, nah, I don't need your gold just, just for, for gold's sake. I mean, eventually an aqueduct wouldn't be bad, but I guess we'll just do the amphitheater at this point. 
Or no, we're going to do some of the tr spiders, spies and traders stuff. Let's do the spy here. I think we can make use of the spy pretty well. Uh, which means the trader probably here, right? Let's go ahead and get the trader done. Here as well. Envoys! We got two envoys. We can get Bandar Brunei back. Which, I mean, it's, we're going to be battling Bandar Brunei the entire time. Probably just get Hansa back, because at least we'll get some gold from that. Yeah, that's probably the right move. Doesn't seem like anybody else is competing with us for Hansa anyway. All right, we're going to put a cut in there when we come back. Well, we got one city down. Let's see if we can get another city here in a few turns. Uh, start working our way across. Eventually, we'll be able to start flipping Ur, I would think, if we get enough stuff over here. Um, currently, I think you're too far away to help us with Ur, right? But you don't have to be in the city state. We can put you anywhere. So we can put you in one of our cities to help start spreading. And the Bomba wouldn't be a bad one just because it would be further in here. Um, so we might do that. I mean, it loses us the chance to get Banner Brunei, but we're kind of give up on that anyway. So yeah, think something like that. We'll figure it out. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you. And I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.